Hey, welcome to Cheaper Jeeper TV, the show that helps you get the most for your money so that you get the most for your Jeep. In this week's episode, we're going to talk about ideal gifts for the Jeep owner in your life who has everything. So stick around. For full transparency, all the gifts were sent to Cheaper Jeeper TV for review. Hi, I'm Dino for Cheaper Jeeper TV, the show that helps you get the most for your money so that you get the most for your Jeep. You may be watching this video because somebody who you care very much about has shared this video with you so you can see some ideal gifts for the Jeeper who has everything. Maybe you can show them how much you care about them by getting them one of these gifts. The gifts could be for anything like Christmas, an anniversary, maybe it's a birthday, maybe it's a graduation, maybe it's a retirement, maybe it's a Valentine's gift, or maybe it's a gift for a new Jeep. It could be for anything. It could be a just because gift. But either way, let's have a look at some of these ideal gift items for the Jeeper in your life who has everything by looking at them in the order from least expensive to most. Coming in at around $10 US are these door lock cover trim pieces. Now these are for the JL. I am aware, however, that they also exist for the JK, but the vendor had sent me these JL ones as I have a JL. And you could see they also come in different colors to match the accent colors that some people use on their Jeeps. It fits nice and snug and gives it a nice clean finished look. And next, coming in at around $17 is a windshield sunshade. You can see how it expands and it folds up into a nice tight package. Now this is meant to keep the sun off your dash so that your Jeep doesn't get too hot in the summer. But when we go camping in the winter, we're going to use it then as well. And now coming in at around $26 is this multi-function top cover net. Now this can be used in the following Jeep models. And here you can see the dimensions of the net. If you like, you can get it in camo or with the American flag for the patriotic ones out there. And those last two cost even less. And I know some people use tops to store things when they're camping, but I think I like this net because it gives you a little bit more room along the sides and I can mount it between the roll bars in the back. So when I'm sleeping in the Jeep with the sleeping camping platform, I can have access to the items that I'm storing up above by reaching around the edge. And now coming in at only around $33 is this A-pillar phone holder bracket made out of all aluminum. This is pretty slick so have a look at this. This is the all aluminum base of the holder and it is secured to the A-pillar with a bolt and then the bolt is covered with a rubber plug. Some rubber pieces are provided to install on the phone holder to provide some cushioning. The small rubber pieces go into the arms of the clamp so that it has more grip. The aluminum adjustable arm is then used to connect the aluminum cell phone base to the aluminum cell phone holder. The cell phone can then be secured to the holder in any orientation that you like and it is very, very solid. This incredibly stable cell phone holder can be mounted to the A pillar at the top or the bottom, even on the passenger side on the top or the bottom. I find myself partial to that lower location for the driver's side, so be on the lookout for that video where I do a full review and install of this awesome cell phone holder. So make sure you subscribe and click that alert bell so you don't miss it. 
When you come back for the installation video, I'm likely to install this cell phone holder at the lower end of the A pillar on the driver's side. It'll look like this when the phone's attached as well. And if that didn't impress you enough, for just around $50 is this all aluminum dashboard mounted cell phone holder. You simply use the two existing screws in the center at the top of your dash to mount this holder securely to your Jeep. You use the square bolt provided to secure to the adjustment arm, which is similar to the other cell phone holder, and then slide it onto the rail where you can attach the cell phone holder in any location and any orientation along the rail. And you're not limited to just your cell phone if you have an action cam or anything else that would use a quarter inch screw to mount it to the adjustment arm, you're set to go. The holder is secured to two screws below this mat. Interestingly, the base for the mount was slightly off and couldn't fit into those grooves where the screws were, so I had to grind the edges a little bit in order to make it fit, and then I spray painted a little bit of black paint as well. Perhaps my 2018 model is different than some newer models, but a word to the wise if you were looking at getting this one that you may have to grind the edges. But after that minor adjustment, it fits like a glove. I tightened the adjuster so that the phone was resting on the edge of the dash and it seemed very very secure in this location and I really like how this works. Look how solid that is. Finally, for $50, a cargo storage bag and toolkit organizer for the tailgate of your Jeep, whether it's a JK or a JL. The kit comes with two bags which have molly straps, pockets, and velcro snaps and hooks to help you secure it to the molly tight backing that secures to the tailgate of the Jeep. Interestingly, rivets are provided to secure that connection for the panel to the tailgate of the Jeep, but I may try self-tapping screws in case I want to change something. I'm also considering putting it on the back of a DIY tailgate table, so stay tuned for that. Hey, I hope you got a few good ideas out of that. And now we'll go to our tip segment so I could talk to you about some ways that you could save some money on these gifts. Now for some cheaper, jeeper tips. For this week's tip segment, I just want to share with you how it's possible to save 20% on the cost of these items. The vendor is going to be having 20% off on these dates for Black Friday for Prime members. However, if you're interested in that cell phone holder that mounts to the A-pillar, which I think is pretty slick, there's going to be a Cheaper Jeeper TV discount code available for the month of December. So you may be interested in that. But I'm also going to do a detailed review on that cell phone holder showing the installation process as well. So if you don't want to miss that, make sure you hit the subscribe button and click the alert bell so that you don't miss that video and others like it. Also, if you're not interested in these gifts, there are these videos here where I've shown the various products that I've reviewed and those videos could also give you some ideas for some ideal gifts for the cheaper in your life who has everything. So now, Let's move on and hear from our subscribers. And now for subscribers tips. This week's subscriber tip comes from last week's video on free location apps. Hey Jeeper Jeeper TV, most mapping software will work offline. However, without downloading the area before losing reception, you will not be able to see the map. You will just see your location on a field of nothingness. 
I recommend downloading the area around where you'll be driving so no matter the cell service, you can actually see the map. Signed, Pretzel. Hey Pretzel, thank you again for another amazing tip. And if any of you out there have tips that you'd like to share, please feel free to put them in the comments section below as they may make it in an upcoming episode. Thank you very much. Hey, that's it for this week's episode of Cheaper Jeeper TV. I hope that it was of value to you and you got some great ideas out of this video or possibly some of the other videos where I reviewed some products. And if you did find it helpful, how about giving this video a thumbs up, maybe share it with somebody who you think might benefit from knowing about these gift ideas. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. So until next week, I'm Dino for Cheaper Jeeper TV. Be well, stay safe, take care.